Hello and welcome to the International Space Station. My name is Shane Kimbrough and I'm an astronaut living and working here 250 miles above the Earth. Today we're going to be learning about what a simple machine is and exploring the different ways we're using simple machines up here in low Earth orbit. A simple machine is an object that helps us to easily accomplish a task by changing the direction or amount of a force. There are six different types of simple machines. A screw, inclined plane, wedge, lever, wheel, and axle and pulley. When we combine two or more of these simple machines together, they are called compound machines. Let's dive into the purpose of each of these devices and how we are using them up here on the station. A screw is a simple machine that helps to fasten two objects together. Up here we use a variety of screws in order to keep our station intact, especially as we deal with microgravity causing objects to drift around. Here's an example of a screw that we may use on a spacewalk. Inclined planes are a broad range of simple machines that use an angled plane to accomplish different tasks. Down on Earth, you use inclined planes to move things easily. But here in microgravity, we don't need inclined planes to help us move objects. If you look closely at a screw, you will see that it is made up of a rod with an inclined plane that spirals around it. This inclined plane helps the screw to fasten to another object. Another simple machine using inclined planes to accomplish something is a wedge. The wedge consists of two inclined planes combined to split or separate objects. We often use wedges to cut objects here on the International Space Station. A wheel and axle is, is exactly what it sounds like. A wheel is attached to an axle, helping it to rotate and move easily without friction. We sometimes use wheels to help move items that we need to be able to travel without floating away. An example of this would be the wheels on our crew equipment and translation aid cart. It is attached to a track using wheel and axles for movement, so we are able to use it on our spacewalks without the possibility of it drifting off. I mentioned compound machines before, and our Advanced Resistive Exercise Device, or ARED, is a great example of that. It combines the simple machines, levers, and pulleys to help us maintain muscle and bone density in micro-G. Levers use a surface situated on a fulcrum, or pivoting point, to move an object. Pulleys are simple machines that use a wheel and axle to change the direction of an object. The pulleys inside ARED allow us to set the level of resistance for our workouts. Thank you for learning about simple machines with me today. Now I'm going to send you back to Earth to design a compound machine you think we could use up here on the International Space Station. See you next time. Subscribe for more space.